Our workshop and just all steps of the entire program process for the Fulbright T program. So please join me in thanking IREX. My name is Dr. Chuck Sartman, and I'm the director of the 2019-2020 Fulbright T program at California State University, Chico. I want to thank the State Department for providing the funds for 110 individuals from across the planet to come to the United States for a six-week experience. I also want to thank the staff of IREX who gave so much of themselves to offer proposals for universities to apply to the program and for providing assistance for the universities throughout the duration of the six-week project. And, but beyond the participants, I want to thank all of the people at the five campuses. I'll speak directly for Chico, the faculty who taught in the program, the friendship families who gave so much of themselves, opened up their homes and hearts to the participants, and also to the teachers in the schools who opened their classrooms, opened their professional repertoire, to the participants of Fulbright T. All I can say in looking back at the program is thank you to one and all. I'm Heather Hacking, Program Manager for the Fulbright Teaching Excellence and Achievement Program at Chico State. And we're done. And it was a beautiful six weeks with a wonderful 22 people from 22 different countries. And um, I think there's a, lot of, there's a lot of classes that they go to, there's a lot of experiences that they have, but what I was most touched um, by was the relationships that the participants had with each other. Not all of them perfect every moment, but we worked through a lot of things that some of them were cultural and some of them were personalities, just like the real world. And just like, I think one of the goals of the program is for people throughout the world to learn to get along with each other better and um, to form a better understanding amongst people. So I think that was definitely achieved here. Hello, I am Bhawani from India and it was a wonderful program. I was at uh, University Chico and we were given the glimpses of American schools, different types of schools, different new methodology. And the most important aspect I would like to focus is that we were given the glimpse of the futuristic American schools, which was very, very new to us. And apart from that, American culture, their society, and some valuable aspects of their values, we were able to understand. I am sure that whatever we have taken, we will try to implement it in our country. And it was a very wonderful cohort. All of our participants from different 22 nationalities were awesome. We learned from them also. Thank you. Hello. I'm Maria from Ukraine. And I would like to share my impressions of this program. Uh, you know, when we were walking along the Golden Gate Bridge, it all kind of clicked. Yes, I learned a lot during this program. But for me, it was very important that I felt validated, appreciated and recognized. And now, coming back home, I, I, I feel more confident uh, standing my ground and I feel more confident sharing the knowledge. So I'm pretty happy about it. Thank you. Hello, nice to meet you. I'm Natalia from Russia. I'm from Chico State University and uh, it was a perfect experience. Uh, we get all the possibilities that we could and uh, it was extremely um, interesting to be in that team, to get all that cultural experience and to be in Chico State. Chico State is the best. Hi, I'm Savara from Uzbekistan and I'm here at the Fulbright Tea program. I've been in California Chico State University and I've learned a lot from my teaching, future teaching and now we are in the Washington DC presenting, having workshops 
I really enjoyed it from the program and uh, I got a lot of experience from my peers and from my coordinators and teachers are great and program is great. Everything was a super. We traveled, we learned and we did uh, some fun. We had some fun with our friends. Everything is great. Thank you. from Lithuania and I need to speak about my Fulbright experience, right? Okay. <laughs> so what was the best that I wanted to know America closer? I, I wanted to see it. It was my dream. So I could say that I achieved my goal. But uh, about my professional goals, yes, I, I can say yes. And I am bringing a lot of information for my teachers, a lot of games for my students, a lot of books to read, a lot of resources to check. So I could say yes, it was great experience. Hello, my name is Svetlana, I'm from Belarus. Uh, Fulbright program is a great chance for me, uh, professional growth, personal growth. Uh, a lot of knowledge for my students and colleagues. I love this program and I'm happy that this program came to me at the right moment. It's just the middle of my life. I have got a lot of experience and uh, I still have a lot of time to share my experience with uh, the people I love. Thank you. Wow. Hi. I'm Elvio from Mozambique and um, I attended my full British students program at Chiku State University. It was an amazing place to be and I've met good people and good professors also. I also enjoyed the environment at the university but I also learned a lot that I will apply in my country as I go back home and I feel like I've be I've changed the whole process of my teaching and Amy Amy is an amazing teacher <laughs> she taught me a lot of things and I shared with her a lot of things mostly literature content and I like the way she teaches her students and I wish I could apply with my students. You take students from literary items to production. I could see them produ producing maskies and talking about maskies. Oh, what amazing teacher is. And I just go home. Oh, lovely students also. They are so educated students and very smart students. I really appreciate the way they attend the classes and the way they react to instructions from the teacher and I wish I could insert these habits in my classes as they go back home. We don't have a lot of conditions but I think only creativity and professionalism is going to be enough for us to, to apply these things. Thank you. Thank you, bro. Hi, I'm Bina Koirala from Nepal. Um, it's an honor for me to be here at the United States representing my country Nepal as a Fulbrighter. And also I'm really proud to say that I was placed at the host university, University of Arkansas, where the Fulbright program was initiated by William J. Fulbright in 1946. I got to learn so many things through this Fulbright Tea program. Um, for instance, I'd like to share how student-centered learning happens um, in the United, uh, United States public schools. I got to know that while visiting um, the public school at Springdale. And also, uh, uh, how students are, um, uh, you know, uh, take initiatives for their own learning, and then they share, they present lots of things to their friends. The teacher takes control, but then the heart of the learning is students. Um, the teacher is not authoritative, but makes sure that the students have lots of activities to do on their own, which I find, uh, which I found the most striking. Thank you. Um, my 
name is Tu from Vietnam. Uh, I'm from writer uh, TA 2020. Uh, it was great uh, program and I'm enjoying so much. And I learned many things here, like uh, the relationship between teachers and students, the technology skills, and uh, the games and activities that I'd like to implement in my classroom. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm Mohan from India. I attended uh, Silver's uh, this workshop session and it was very uh, great session and I like one of his uh, points that he worked collaboratively uh, from the uh, University of Wilmington and uh, she how he collaborated the person from uh, his country, uh, uh, Ma, and uh, did a collaborative presentation before all the participants by uniting the uh, participants from the two different states of the United States. This is a very good example of uh, working in collaboration and uh, I like it and uh, the, and I uh, uh, find that the, he will be taking this idea back home in working in a uh, team manner and it will be great for us and a very good example for the, all the full writers. Go ahead, Silver.